Hello, my name is Alex Chernis. I'm a master level social worker with Med Council. I joined Med Council in 2007 with the World Trade Center program, a case management service for the ground zero recovery workers and their families. In addition to English, I speak Russian, Polish, and Ukrainian. As a son of Holocaust survivor, I have a special concern for vulnerable people. I helped to establish Med Council Weinberg Senior Aid Program in 2008. This is an example of our work. Ms. F is 91 years old, visually impaired with limited mobility. She lives on a less than $1,500 a month. She is a Jewish widow. Her husband fought in Pacific during World War II for which he was awarded a bronze star for bravery. Her only child, Jay, received the Ellis Island Medal of Honor for services to the community in 2007. Jay is 72 years old, retired, who lives in another bore on a fixed income. There is no grandchildren, however, a niece helps when she can. This year, when Ms. F was renewing her senior citizen rent increase exemption, which is rent fees paid in part by the city, Ms. F complained about repairs, which landlord ignored. The city worker referred her to Med Council. I completed an assessment in her home, include but not limiting, screening for her cognitive impairment, safety, medical and social needs, and all benefits and entitlements, and determine that she is eligible for food stamps. She didn't know about food stamps. Getting them represents an increase of 153 per month every time. First, however, she had applied. She was helped to complete the mail-in application. Then she was notified she had to go to the food stamp office for finger imaging. Med Council provided a car service and volunteer to escort her to food stamp office. After a month, I follow up on her application only to discover that her case is closed. I help to make use of legal services through New York Legal Assistant Group so she could get retroactive and ongoing food stamps. In addition, Med Council New York Legal Assistant Group collaborated with Ms. F, giving her son power of attorney and the right to act as her healthcare proxy. These documents give her great peace of mind. Med Council met her pair handyman fix the floor in her apartment, therefore reducing risk of falling. They also fixed the clock train and made other minor home repairs. I go to see or call her at least once a week. In addition, the team nurse is in routine contact with Ms. F. Ms. F is not eligible for Medicaid, so in-home care service would be her financial responsibility. Therefore, Med Council Senior Aid Register Nurse visit her in home at least every two weeks to check on her vital signs and other address her other medical needs. In conclusion, as a result of Med Council services, Ms. F received ongoing intensive case management, visiting nursing service, legal services, and emergency cash assistance. Ms. F expressed her gratitude that the council assists her to remain independently in her home and continue safely live within her community.